Happy Tuesday afternoon, everybody. This is the Tuesday afternoon woofer walk with woofer walker Justin and uh, his wonderful woofers. Hi, Luna. You're one of them. <laughs> there's Poppy. And there's Casey. And there's Big Poppy. And we got uh, Ruby and Harold here having a hoot, as they do. <laughs> Harold's is gonna run and run and run. And way out there, Timo. So lately, I've been get, letting Timo off, off of the umbilical for this little stretch. I found it's another spot that I can give him some freedom on because uh, we're headed towards where he wants to go and there's no other temptations like uh, other trails to take and stuff. So as long as I keep heading this way and he's not behind me, it works out, so. I'm able, I've been able to give them a little bit more freedom, which is great because then I don't have to uh, worry too much and uh, I also don't have to have them attached to me for this section, which is nice. And uh, I just kind of pick it up on the way and I pretty much just hook them back up just before the trailhead and then take them off again on the way to the beach because I know that's where he wants to go. So he's been getting a bit more freedom, which has been nice. Because ultimately, the goal is to have everybody running around off leash. That's what we like to do. Not always possible, but we do our best. Hey, Luna. Well, that snow, that snow that was supposed to show up never materialized, so kind of too bad, but kind of okay as well. I'm glad that things melted have melted here a little bit, because yesterday, this whole section was just a big ice rink, and it was a little... A little sketchy to walk on. Uh, but it's great today. It's a little... It's smoshy. Hi, Harold. How's it going, buddy? How you doing? Good boy. So I just got a little lead on him, just in case I need to... Uh, get everyone together. At least you never know. He's really good, though. He probably doesn't need it. But I just kind of have it on... Sometimes if I just need to collect a bunch of dogs at once... It just helps to have leashes on the margin. <laughs> Casey! So I'm gonna try here just to make sure that they don't go up too far ahead. So I'm gonna have to gather gather Timo up before we get close to the trailhead. Okay, we'll catch up in a bit. Wait, we'll just... Okay, we got Harold and Casey running around again. I thought I heard a bark coming from over there. It's weird because that's coyote territory. Unless one guy had these two huge ridgebacks that would go and just, if they saw anything, they'd just go running over there. Hopefully they never caught those coyotes because those are big, scary dogs. Coyotes wouldn't have much of a chance. Hey, all right, I gotta put the kibosh on this. <laughs> 